Good morning. This is another edition of Laughing Wagamorphs. And I have Boniface here, who's not really a happy camper this morning. Um, I wanted to show you, if I could, it's hard because he's got black fur, but the texture, you know, I've, I told you I've been pulling fur. See how it, it's very gentle. And there's fur underneath. So that's what we would call a molt. He's already done it over his head and back. And so now we're working on, okay, on a fist, it's okay. Yeah, he's, he gets like this. This is the defensive aggressive. And so if I had another hand, I could show you that I'm not an octopus. I don't, you know, you don't, you need to pull, look at his backside. See that? That's, you know, just above his tail, but you see all that fur. It's short there and it's long elsewhere. And, and on his sides, come on, baby. Come on, honey, don't do that. He doesn't like to feel trapped. But, oh my gosh, the fur is everywhere. So, he wants his treats. I've disrupted his morning routine. And it's my fault. So, we have, we have a routine. And I need to give him his treats now for being a good boy. Uh, go, bunny. We have to do claw clipping. I'm just kind of showing you. Well, there he goes. Okay. He's taken off. He'll probably head back to his pen. You can kind of see it. You can see the texturing there. And, uh, well, I hope this little video was informative on the difference between a shed and a molt. Um, I wish I had somebody that I could use to help me but like I said I cradle him in my lap when I'm doing the plucking I don't know what else to call it the plucking and um, you know he, he loves it he really does he tooth purrs he just doesn't like this aspect of being videoed and now we're hopping into the potty box to do our business good boy Good bunny. Good bunny. That's my good baby. That's a good Boniface. Yes, that's a good Boniface. That's a good bunny. Boy, he really had to go. He's still peeing. <laughs> I can tell he's peeing because he's got his tail lifted up. What a good bunny. I hate to violate your potty box privacy. What a good bunny. And he's nibbling on hay, so he's doing his other business also. <laughs> what a good bunny. And his gate to his pen is open so he comes and he goes so it's not like he's trapped in there except at night I do um, put them down for the night there's his stuffy he loves that stuffy that stuffy is just his best friend but anyway I do put them down for the night I found especially with Boniface he almost killed himself a couple of times having night frights when I first got him. So, um, uh, anyway, it was just safer for him to be in his pen at night and in his hidey house, which is like sacred space. And, um, you know, he just, he's happy here. I know it looks like a hot mess, but he's a bunny. 
and I usually neaten that up and freshen up the hay, but it's Sunday and I have to, you know, get to church and stuff, and so I'll deal with that when I get back. Um, anyway, sorry for the prolonged. <laughs> I just love watching him. He's such a good bunny. He's such a good boy. Okay, ta-ta for now from Laughing Lagomorphs.